Hi guys, Kelly here, and today I am talking about Jeffree Star and Blood Sugar Pellet. Okay, so I really, really love the packaging. That's my honest to God favorite thing about this whole palette is just the packaging. I do like the color story inside, and I do like the formula. Um, I hope that he eventually one day will come out with uh, single shadows. But, uh, that we can get from palettes. But, whatever. Um, so I do like that it has little hinges, and I do plan on keeping this box and gutting it when I'm done with the shadows. I have no idea what I'll use it for, but maybe I'll metallicize it. Metallicize it? Mag make it magnetic on the bottom so I can put other shadows in it. Who knows? Anyways, um, so, sorry for the camera shake, this little thing pops up on my phone that says that Google is no longer working, blah, 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 we don't care about that, we care about this, but that's why my phone shakes, because of that. I'm just going to leave it alone because it keeps doing it, it pops up like every two seconds. So this is the color story, and um, it's a really pretty color story, though one thing that I love the most is that there's only like one, two like three or four there's like four shimmers in here it's one that is like super shimmery but the rest are all mattes and that's one of the things that i love about jeffree star is that he always adds more mattes than you normally would get in any other palette um for instance i want to talk about a show of palettes that i've already reviewed so here's the daisy Mar marquee from uh, the beach palette and you know this one has an even mixture of both shimmers and mattes but uh yeah so I really won't say anything about that because it has an even mixture damn <laughs> so I guess with me it's just always been I always feel that more shadows more shadow palettes don't have that um have more mats in them or they have like two or three mats and you really gotta find it really it can be hard to work with the two or three mats when you have all shimmers um so but I guess I should swatch them I have an itchy arm I actually I keep getting itchies all over the place I don't know why don't need to take a shower so this first one is called glucose which is a nice white color and so here's that nice white the next one is called sugar cane which is a great transition shade for my eyes or a base shade if you will And then we have Cake Mix, which is also would be a nice base shade for me as well. And then we have Ouch, kind of looks like that, like a day old scab color. And then here is the first shimmer shade or metallic shade in the thing it's right here and this one is called donor and then we have this very last one on this row which is a mat and it's called intravenous and we'll take it down the middle right there look how long that swatch went though and i could still just re run it back and forth alright so the next shade is the next row first one it's called candy floss and that's what's on my eyes right now and it is a shimmer and it packs really well let me change my light and then we have tongue pop which is actually what I used for the inner uh, crease 
of my eyelids now. And then we have Sweetener, which is a, another shimmer. It's kind of almost a multi-chrome. Almost. Because it, when you move, it turns gold. So, and that is the shade right here. And then we have Cavity, which is a bright Jeffree Star pink. And then we have O Positive, which I could have also used as a transition shade for myself. It is a really, really light taupe. Is it taupe or taupe? There's that. Can you see? It looks like a bruise almost. And then we have a root canal, which is a joke, what I'm calling a joker purple. Okay, so now we're going to, oh, the itches down here. Okay, so now we're going to go down here to Brick. It's just a little Brick. So and this is the lightest red shade in the whole bunch. And then we have Cherry Soda. I actually drink Cherry Soda. I drink Diet Cherry Pepsi. And then we have Fresh Meat, which, uh, this looks more like if it was bloody. Like, really bloody, like, just, you just killed the animal. And then here is the namesake of the palette, called Blood Sugar. And it is a shimmer. Metallic, whatever you want to call it. And then we have Extraction had a couple of those. Those are not fun. I had one doctor who was just completely rude. Like, he took my tooth and it was on this side. Or was it on the... It was on this side. And he sheared off most of it. And then he took a screw and he screwed it down in there. And then he took, like, this tool and just popped it out. And it makes this really horrible sound. And I can't stand it. Anyways, the last one is called Coma, and I love the fact that the one that's called Coma has a caduceus on it. So, there we go. That's all the shades. So, I really like the palette. Um, I've never not liked a Jeffree Star palette. I've never been like, oh my god, this is the worst palette ever. I loved his his Beauty Killer, I loved his Thirsty, I loved his Alien, and I loved this one. Um, I am on the fence about getting androgyny just because I look at it and I think to myself, is there, I'm going to be paying, you know, like, you know, I think it's like $45. I'm going to be paying $45. <sighs> am I actually going to use any of the products that are in, or any of the eyeshadows that are in the palette? So, a lot of the times, I'm not doing that. Look at, what is that? Did I get something on my face? I did, I got makeup on my face. I'm going to be taking up all, all this makeup anyway. So, my face probably looks a bit old, like a big old mess, but it's been on my face since like 11 o'clock this morning, and it's now 8 o'clock at night. So, um, and I will leave a description in the box below. But what I'm wearing, or I will try to remember to do so, it doesn't always happen. I always forget, like, I always forget to do shout-outs. Like, I should have a list of all my subscribers so that I can shout you guys out, and I completely forget every single time. I forget everything. But, um, yes. I will be getting Blue Blood because I really, really like that color story. I hope... I'm hoping for a green to come out. I would love a really uh, bright and deep green with lots with with you know a mix of shimmers and and mattes. Um, so I hope you're watching, Jeffrey. I hope you do a green palette. Um, call it lizard blood. I don't know. Um, or you could call it alien blood. Um, yes. 
Anyways, guys, I love you so, so much. Thanks for watching. I still have my Juvia's Place palettes to uh, review. Um, I have worn some of them, so I will. I have already gone through and decided whether I like them or not, and I will review them in a couple of days. Um, let's see what else. June, my birthday is up. My birthday is coming up next month, so look for a birthday haul video, maybe, maybe. I don't know. Yeah, I don't know. I want to apologize for my nails because they look like crap. I hurt myself, and it's gonna really hurt hurt using acetone to take off my nail polish. So I'm dreading that. Alright guys, I love you so, so much. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in my very next video. Remember to always be you, stay strong, and be beautiful. Bye guys!